Hello and welcome to Let Them Talk, the channel that goes deeper into everything about the English language. And one of the most common questions I get as an English teacher is, how long will it take me to speak English fluently? And although I don't really like this question because people shouldn't be thinking about some abstract point in the future rather than focusing on learning something today, I do have an answer. And the answer is that if you start learning from scratch, from nothing, it will take you 10,000 hours. Now, obviously, some people learn a little quicker than others, and some people have good strategies for learning, such as watching Let Them Talk TV, which is an excellent choice, by the way. But on average, it will take 10,000 hours, which is approximately 10 years, depending on the number of hours you spend learning each day. Now, this figure is not something I made up myself. It comes from an excellent book by Malcolm Gladwell called Outliers, and I do recommend it. And of course, he wasn't specifically talking about learning English. But what he does say is that any complex task, and when I say a complex task, I mean things such as learning a musical instrument, becoming a successful tennis player, learning your job, and learning a language. These consistently take about 10,000 hours before you become really good. He believes that talent is overrated and really it's mostly about hard work. Take Bill Gates for example. Computing genius? Well, probably not, but what he did do was spend thousands of hours learning how to program as a kid. While most of the kids of his age were watching TV and hanging around on street corners. I don't know. Uh, now you can look at this in two ways. Firstly, you can say, I oh, know, 10,000 hours, that's a lot of hours. I can't possibly dedicate so much time to learning English or whatever it is you're doing. And you can, you can give up, which is what most people do most of the time. Perhaps like me, you've started learning a musical instrument and you, 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 you get discouraged because you're not making progress as easily as expected. You give up, okay? I started learning the guitar many years ago and because I couldn't play like Jimi Hendrix after a few weeks, I packed it in. Remember, most people who begin learning a language fail. Have you ever started learning a language other than English and given up? I know I have. Most people who begin learning the piano don't get very far. Most people who start doing a sport don't become very good. But some people, some people will push on. So the other way to look at this is as something quite liberating. So talent plays just a small part. Most of the success is hard work, which means that whatever your age, whatever your background or situation, anybody can learn a language. We know it's true because you've already done it once. If you are constantly learning, constantly acquiring knowledge and adding new words, adding new grammar, you will succeed, whoever you are. Or you can be like the, the other 90% and, and give up. It's, it's your choice. You can do anything. You just don't expect to be good in a short time. Uh, the whole language learning industry is predicated on, on failure. Most people won't succeed. And I see books and online courses that say, learn English in no time and without effort. Learn English in 10 minutes a day while you're in the bathroom. Well, I'm sorry to say that that is nonsense. Yes, it will take time, it will take effort, but you'll enjoy it and in the end, although there is, really is no end because you always carry on learning, uh, you'll, but you will see that it is worth it and it will enhance 
your life. It might even help you in your professional career as well. And then you can call yourself a fluent English speaker. And remember that this all is not just for learning a language. So whatever you want to do, you can do it. Just you need to get inspired. Be committed and focused and do the necessary work. And that's it. So th thanks to Malcolm Gladwell. I put a link in the description to his book if you want to, to read more. By the way, it's not an affiliate link it's just a, a good book uh, and uh, what do you think do you agree with the 10,000 hour rule does it does it inspire you or does it does it depress you uh, let us know in the comments and thank you for watching stay mellow and I'll see you in the next video